today we are having lunch at my in-laws Ryan's parents. What was I gonna ask? Go ahead, Daddy. Look. Okay, I can't even get her in this. <laughs> Drop it. Oh, she already popped. Drop it. It's one more, daters. Last one. Ready? Whoop. Oh my goodness. She's like a volleyball dog. She's like Air Bud. <laughs> She's like Air Bud. Fun daters? No. Ooh. Jesus, this is terrible, Mom. Leo would like that. She's trying to get on the chair when you do that. I know. Daddy, you gotta go all the way. <laughs> we are out for a walk, and it looks like a bunch of apples. All hidden, apples. hidden under some grass. What the heck? This is strange. Look, somebody built like a little bridge here. I don't know what this one's for. Actually, I think that one used to be down here, but that now there's that one. It broke. Kind of strange. Okay, Levi. Hmm. I'm pretty sure kids like dirt bike and ATV and stuff back here. Which is kind of strange for like suburbs, but it's a nice little wooded area, so it's what they do. Are you okay? Oh, did you hit a stump or something? Do you want to go back on the street? Mm -hmm. I'll just watch where I'm walking. Yeah. I did see it, but it must be just got the back of my foot. Oh, that's not good. So, yep, we've got both pups out. Holy cow, this is pretty long. It's like the road less traveled. Levi's upset we don't have a retractable for him. Yeah, so he's just on his normal daily leash, the short guy. Yeah. He doesn't like it. No, you don't like it, buddy? He would be fine off, but he would... Daisy. I think she sees something. Does he? She does, I think. She keeps like... Oh, there's a squirrel back there. Is there? Yeah, yep. So here's a few pictures of me and my brother's children. This is me. That's my brother. Um, I don't know, let's see. Oh, this was Easter 1997, so I would have been four? Four. I think I was four in that picture. Oh, and then look at that. There's me as a baby. Baby. Look at that baby. And that, I believe, was in either second? Yeah, second grade, I think. I want to say it's second grade. Do you know who that is? Does anybody know what that is on my shirt? If you do, put it in the comments below. Because if you know that, that means you're awesome. There's me again. And my brother. And me and my brother. Look at me. Look at that long hair, guys. It's like ridiculously long. Look like I could be a girl. Oh, and there's me with my shaved head. Nope, oh, there's some long hair again. Holy crap, that's long. That's crazy. How many pictures are on there? Um, six. Oh, I didn't know that many. Yeah, I think mom slowly been adding more. She's probably sad because all of her kids are gone. Probably. Look at me. Look at me. My brother is four years older than, like, four years and a couple months older than me. So that's why you can see more of an age difference in these pictures. But yep, there's me as a child. I was so cool. Okay, maybe not. Maybe not so much, but it's fun stuff. Oh, here's, here's a good one. Here's a good one. 
this, I don't even know how old I was in this picture. But this is my oldest cousin, who's actually getting married this Saturday. This is his younger brother. And there's my brother. And there's me. All the way at the bottom, because I was too small to climb. But as you know, I love to climb trees now. It's 9.30 at night. We just got home from Ryan's parents. We and did, now we had a shopping trip there. We had a shopping trip there. <laughs> and now I'm cleaning out the pantry, putting away mm -hmm. the food in there. We're having dinner now because we didn't eat we haven't eaten dinner yet. So we're having dinner at 9.30. And we're having some hot dogs and some mac and cheese. Like super old school, feel like a little kid. That's like what we're having. But it sounds delicious, so I'm excited. Yeah. Levi, of course, is sleeping in the least perfect place, right in the walkway of our nest. As always. And I, I don't know where Daisy went. Uh, she's somewhere. I don't know. Daisy is thirsty. Apparently, drank just finished all her water because she was just drinking. So now she's drinking out of Levi's bowls. Thanks for adding some interesting stuff, Daisy. Hey, Daters. Do you want me to get you some water? So, I have no idea how much footage we have today. We spent a good part of the day at Ryan's parents' house, and we did some pay jobs and stuff. Our, uh, well, my brother, sister-in-law, his brother, and sister-in-law. giant cucumber. They made these in their home garden. They made them, yep. They did. They, I mean, they grew them. <laughs> they right. grew them in their garden. They brought a bunch over to Ryan's parents' house. And we took one, and it's humongous. But we like cucumbers, so we're gonna cut those up. Mungo. I think we we're going to answer yesterday's question, mm -hmm. which is favorite book that you read. I mean, there's so many different topics for books that it's yeah. hard to choose a specific one. As I'm sure many of you know, and I know a lot of your comments said, you couldn't pick just one good book. One best book I should yeah. say other than the Bible I think um, my top one would probably have to be um, 13 resolutions for life by Orrin Woodward um, basically like it's based on 13 resolutions that Benjamin Franklin like came up with and implemented into his life and just basically along the same lines and help you improve yourselves and what you do on a daily basis. Fantastic book, I would highly recommend it. I haven't read <clears throat> um, fiction books since high school. So, only other books I have also like him is self-help books. And probably my top one, because I read a lot of marriage books, would probably be Becoming the Woman of His Dreams, which is very self-explanatory about becoming your husband's woman of his dreams. <laughs> so that was probably my favorite book that I read, self-help wise. And then fiction though, which I'm going back to like high school grade reading, was I really liked the book Beastly. I don't think the movie lived up to the standards, but I really liked the book. And basically it was like a modern set, Beauty and the Beast. They made a movie, I don't think it really got, like, huge. Vanessa Hudgens played the girl in it. And it was a good movie still, but it did not live up to the expectations of the book, I didn't think. Mm. But it wasn't bad. I didn't think, like, it was, it ruined the book or anything like that. But that was probably my favorite one that I read. Hey, what are you doing? Fiction, fiction-wise, books that I haven't, like, like she, I haven't read fiction books in a long time. But the two best series that I read was the Splinter Cell series and the Left Behind Kids series. Yeah, he read all of them. There's like 40 of them. The first, like one through five, were kind of tough to get through um, just because it was all like getting the background started on everybody. But once you got past that, it was phenomenal. Mm -hmm. So good. I never read any of those. Well, they <laughs> were awesome. They had them all in our church library, and I think I might have read one and two, 
but then never finished, yeah. which probably because they were boring. Yeah. So the I first, just didn't. <laughs> first few were tough to get through. What's today's question? Um, this is one that doesn't really apply to us. Okay. But I know there's a lot of people out there that enjoy it. What is your favorite sport to either play or watch and favorite team? in that sport. I could answer a favorite sport to play. Yeah, I know. That's why I added that in there. So we actually have a question to answer. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go. What is your favorite sport to play and or watch? And what is your favorite team for that favorite for that sport, sport that you that like sport. to watch? Yep. There you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're going to end the vlog now. We hope you guys enjoyed it. And give it a thumbs up for Daisy's mad balloon skills. I'm hoping I was able to get good footage because she moves around so much it was hard to keep her in the frame. But she did some mad volleyball skills. And Ryan's being creepy, isn't he? No, I'm not. You were totally creeper smiling back there, I weren't you? I was not. I'll know when I edit. I know. <laughs> we'll see you I'm guys. I'm keeping them in your team. Oh, okay. I'm boring. Am I being whoops? Creeper. <laughs> no, I'm just giving them something to laugh at. No. We'll see you guys tomorrow. We hope you have a good day. And yeah. Hit that thumbs up. For Daisy's mad balloon skills.